Did you know, when you eat white rice, your body treats it almost like a fast fuel source? As you chew, your teeth break the soft grains into smaller pieces, while saliva begins working on the starch, turning it slightly sweet. The chewed rice slides down your esophagus into the stomach, where acid and enzymes mix it into a smooth, starchy chyme. Because most of the outer bran and fiber were removed during processing, this starch is easy for your small intestine to break down quickly. In the small intestine, enzymes slice the starch into simple glucose molecules, which are rapidly absorbed through the villi into your bloodstream. Your blood sugar rises, and your pancreas responds by releasing insulin, the hormone that helps move glucose from the blood into your muscles and liver for energy or storage as glycogen. If there's more glucose than you need right now, some can eventually be stored as fat. The fast rise and fall of blood sugar and insulin can leave you feeling hungry again sooner, especially if you ate mostly white rice without much protein, fat, or fiber. Over time, large portions of refined starches at many meals can put extra pressure on your blood sugar control system, especially if you're inactive or already at risk for diabetes. At the same time, a reasonable portion of white rice can still provide quick energy and small amounts of B vitamins and minerals, and it's easier to digest than some whole grains for sensitive stomachs. Best advice. Enjoy white rice in modest portions. Combine it with protein, healthy fats, and fiber-rich vegetables to slow absorption, and rotate it with higher fiber options like brown rice or mixed grains to keep your blood sugar and energy more stable.